What up, B Squad? So, I'm doing something a little different today. I'm doing like a little vlog. So, I'm like, <laughs> I've been like really behind on like my influencer stuff. Like, um, just like post and like, sorry, I'm looking at the screen. Post and like reviewing content or reviewing products and stuff like that. So, now I have a bunch of just shit or crap because they might block me in my like area, which y'all can't really see, but it's just like <sighs> so dirty over here so i figured i would do a little vlog i did a lot of the stuff i needed to do yesterday and i didn't think about it but i figured i would do a um figured i would do a i don't know little mini influencer day in the life vlog so i just got up actually i work night so my schedule is a little off so i just got up it's 7 20 now so i got up around like 5 30 or 5 15 so yeah i'm gonna go get my matcha get something to eat but I guess I would just take you guys with me because this is like a day in the life of me when I do my influencer stuff. But just, just for you that don't know, um, I do have a full-time job. I'm a manager uh, full-time. So I work like 50 hours a week. So then when I'm off, I'm trying to do all my influencer stuff, which is kind of frustrating or like sometimes hard to do. But I love doing this. I'm just always super tired. What? I'm all outside. And never really take any time to like... Y'all excuse my wig because I just threw her on, okay? Um, but... I don't take that much time for myself. So I'm wearing this hoodie that I got from Shein. I am doing a Shein haul. Funny story, I freaking filmed the whole haul and then realized how bloated I was. I was like on my period. So I period. Period. I was super, super bloated. So some of the clips I'm going to go back and refilm now that I'm not bloated anymore. But like I said, that's on the list of other things I have to do. So now I got to go back and refilm that. And I'm vlogging on my phone so I know the... Um, quality is not the same i'm sorry i don't have a vlogging camera and my my t6i is too bulky and too big to carry around trying to vlog so this is like all i have right now so sorry in advance guys all right let's go my apartment is a freaking mess so i was trying to clean it up but we just have stuff everywhere there's my macbook i kind of like work in this little area right here on the couch or like over here where i film i don't really have anywhere else to work but i usually like if i'm doing makeup or something i'll film in that corner and then i'll just watch tv the TV's right here from over there or if I'm editing or something I'll just sit in here and I'll turn my uh, softbox lights around because for some reason when it's like really white good lighting I feel like I work better so like I'll just like turn these around if I am over here and then I'll just turn the light on because it's like that good white light I don't know it's something about like yellow light like how you can tell now this this is like yellow light or whatever um I don't know Yellow light, I feel like, puts me in, like, a chill, not do anything mood. So, I try to, like, use the white light to stay productive. And I feel like it works. So, if y'all do this, y'all try it out and see if it helps for y'all. Because don't, I feel like I'm not crazy. I feel like it's a thing. Also, there's Jack. He's trying to play. Say hi, baby. <laughs> okay. So, yeah. I'm going to go get my um, matcha and we're going to go. It's basically dark now. The struggle of working nights and getting up when it's dark outside every day. It sucks. But yeah, it, it's like 36 degrees outside. Y'all freaking hate Illinois. Like, I miss this job. This weather fucking sucks. And um, yeah, I hate it. So, it is spring, but not spring. It's still cold. Ooh, it's so irritating. Um, yeah, like they're literally like flurries getting stuck in my window. It is what what day is it? March 30th or something like that. But yeah, oh, y'all see this gloss? This is the gloss that I got from Rimmel. It's so bomb, it's not sticky at all. Y'all, I fucking hate sticky gloss, but like a lot of it is sticky. What the y'all? It's legit snowing. Hold on, I can't make this up. I can't make this up. It's legit snow and it's all April. And it's like, it's not gonna stick because it's above freezing, but still, what the heck. Um, but yeah, this gloss is from Rimmel. Mm, 
they sent it to me in PR, so I have a couple more. So I want I'll show you those, you guys, that as part of this vlog, I guess, because I'm not gonna unbox it. Because people don't, when I do unboxings, people don't really watch them. So I was like, okay, yeah, I'll just do it on my Instagram. So if you're not following me on Instagram, what are you doing? Follow me on Instagram at the lovely B, three E's and an underscore. I'll put it in the video for you. Do it. Pause the video, go do it, come back, okay? But yeah, so my life in a nutshell. This is what happens behind the scenes. <laughs> so yeah, we're about to go to Starbucks and get matcha. I got Jason one too, cause he getting off early tonight and he, I got him hooked on matcha too. Uh, yeah. And I got it, I originally got it from Kyra Omanique, like that's my bitch, okay? But I tweak mine, I do more vanilla because I don't like the grassy taste of matcha, the super grassy taste, so I add a little bit more vanilla to it, but you know, it's good, good, okay? So, um, that's basically it. We about to drive and yeah. All right, so, back, back, back it up, all, back, back, back it up, all, back. My camera dirty. All right, it's over vlogging and driving thing. Don't do it. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay, so I'm actually about to go check my mail because one of my friends got her own business, okay, and she just wants some products. And basically, uh, she's sending me a little package of them so i'm gonna unbox them on this vlog because why not support your friends we can all make these bags together like why not okay i think i'm gonna get some food from chipotle this is the one bad thing about it okay so I'm so tired on my off days, but I have like stuff because I, I have to be consistent on social media because I really, really want it, but I'm so freaking tired when I'm off. What? I'm so And I'm on the night shift schedule, which means I'm sleep when people reaching out to me. So then I wake up at like four or something and then I'm trying to catch up on emails and stuff. And like, I'm not like super, super, you know, a super big content creator. Yeah. Um, but. I will be I'm manifesting it you know what I'm saying but like it's just trying to create that balance and I had a really bad depression week last week so I like last weekend I just didn't do anything I was just so bummed down the dumps and just depressed like I just couldn't even function it was like a bad depression um, spell like or whatever you want to call it because usually I can like brush it off and be okay and last week I could not I was like fuck like mm, mm, I gotta stop cussing I'm like forget this I don't want to do this like I don't even want to do my job like I just want to stay at home all day so yeah i'm just burnt out really and i realized that i was burnt out so i booked a vacation i'm going on vacation in a couple weeks so i'm gonna vlog that but yeah i was just over it so i didn't get anything done which put me even farther behind all right the light just turned green so be back okay, so this starbucks i gotta find a new starbucks because they're always too busy but um i did a mobile order so i could technically walk in and get it mm -hmm. actually i think i am gonna walk in and get it because i ordered it already and they be going slow Look at this, look at this, look at this, look at this. What is this, what is this, what is this, what is this? No ma'am, where are you going, sir? Where are you going? Get off the way. All right. Ooh, I see my matches. All right, so I'm about to go into Chipotle and get some food. So when I have like to film or take pictures or something, I just usually get up, get um, coffee, matcha, or whatever, and food, so I won't have to go back out or worry about anything. And then I just I'm in the house working on stuff. So I'm about to go in here. I know people are gonna stare at me, so I'm not gonna vlog when I'm in there, but I'll talk to y'all in a second. So I'm getting my bowl made. So when I go to Chipotle, I get you need to try this. Okay, write it down. Brown rice, half carnitas, half babacoa queso hot salsa lettuce cheese and sour cream just like that get a bowl if you've never had their bowl you need to try their bowl um anyways this guy who was making my bowl was newer and i was getting two of them because i was getting one for jason but like the other guy standing next to him he was like oh don't give him too much meat excuse me bro don't you ever in your life tell him not to give me too much meat i'm okay with that 
stay in your lane. You're on the soft side. He's on the meat side, okay? I'm pretty impressed about that. Like, he blocking my blessings right now. I need that, okay? I need that today. I need that energy. You just messed up my energy telling him not to put all the meat in there. Like, ah. Woo, but yeah, I'm just on the way home now. Um, Dang, I should have took you guys with me when I went to Ulta. Anyway, but yeah, I'm gonna go home. I gotta take some pictures for um a campaign I gotta do. And I'll tell you a little bit more about how I find like little campaigns to do when I get there. Mr. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, this Abby in the back. Uh on this, I'm watching Abby and uh well Vicky's video. <laughs> but yeah, so um he didn't give me enough meat. He gave me all this fucking rice. I'm pissed. But this is really good. Usually if you get a good amount of meat. He just gave me a bunch of rice. So, so here's a good like example of me being like so I was super motivated and now I just don't feel motivated at all. So I'm literally just sitting on the couch. So this is just part of my depression. But I'm going to get up in a minute and do all the stuff I need to do. But yeah, it's a struggle. Anyway, so to try to motivate myself, I look at some of my favorite YouTubers. I watch them on YouTube. Watch a couple of their videos. And sometimes it motivates me because it's like goals. And like, I don't know. Some of them have like really good spirit and stuff like that. So yeah, I watch them. This one is Tierra Walker. I love her. Um, I'm trying to un. Uh, there we go. She just has such good vibes. And she's so cute. Look at her. Okay, so here's a good example of me using this light. I was like eating. Here's my matcha. I'm about to drink this. So I was like, this is my order, y'all. I gotta drink this before I eat my quiche. Try it. Um. I don't know, I'm feeling kind of down and discouraged, so I'm watching Kyra. Hey girl, I'm watching her, I love her channel, um, but yeah, I'm about to actually move over here because I have some things that I need to take pictures of, well specifically one thing that I need to take a picture of. Look at these lashes I got y'all. Off of AliExpress. <laughs> There's a scandal behind these. Those are some samples for the shirt. I'm coming out with a shirt company. Yes. Coming soon, coming soon. This is kind of what it looks like so far. So be on the lookout for that. This is the gloss that I was talking about by Rimmel. Focus, babe. Okay, the Rimmel Steak and Lossy Gloss. Y'all need to try it out. It is dope. All right, so I was telling you I got a package for my friend. Sorry, let me talk closer to the phone because the air, the heat is on. Because it's so cold outside, what? Um, this is a package I was seeing from my friend, Mariah. So the name of her um, company is a Queen's Cologne. And look at this. This is actually really cute. I like the bag. I like, this is her logo. And I like that she has a logo all over the front of it. This is cute. Yes, girl, you better. Okay, so these are some of the glasses she has. Ooh, these are cute. They're like clear, but they're so cute. I don't know, I like them. They're like reflective. Yes, girl, you better. I love this. And then this necklace is so pretty. Like, look at this. Insane. So when I get packages, I usually just um, unbox them and then I'll post it on my Instagram too. To let people know what I'm getting. I have I actually have an unboxing little highlight on my Instagram. So yeah, I'm gonna post about this on my Instagram. It's also in a package. It's like a do-rag or head scarf, whatever you want to call it. But oh girl, yes. I need one of these. And this is so dope. This is cute. Oh, I have to post a Instagram photo for this company, and it's called Splendy. And they are an underwear subscription service, which I had never heard of before. I think it's kind of cool. I can always use more underwear because, you know. But it came in like a little mailer, and this is like the little paper that it was in there. And I'll show you guys. They sent me three pair. It comes with three pair every month. So they sent me three pair. And um, basically, I asked them for a size medium because I wasn't sure how big these are in. But these are all size mediums. And I think I'm going to do a flat lay photo of the of these you know for them 
because something about putting them on, but there was like nothing too risque or too, you know, too much. And I don't want to be really close to that line. I feel like if it was like a swimsuit, I would, but since they're underwear, I'm like, nah. So I'm thinking about doing a flat lay on this little marble surface right here. Or I might try a couple different areas. Maybe like my rug. I have like a rug too that is kind of cute. But yeah, we're just going to get into that. Oop, does it start? Yes. All right, so here are the three pairs that I got. So I'm going to insert a clip, but I usually go onto their website. My website. I go onto their, when I'm working with a brand and I'm creating a picture for them or a photo or a video, whatever it may be, I go onto their page and see what type of content they're sharing, see what kind of angle, see what they're, also I look at what they're tagged in. But I mostly focus on the things that they are reposting and posting on their page because that's obviously the look that they're trying to go for. I try to take those looks and try to make my, make it my own and like kind of remix it or, you know, add a little B spin to it, okay? And then, you know, I take a couple, I edit it, and then I send it over. So um, the app that I use is called Aspire IQ. It used to be Revfluent. Still looking basic, but um, yeah, you log into Aspire Aspire IQ, and you can basically connect all of your. Mm, don't look at my great bottle. You can connect all of your um, social media and it'll basically estimate your engagement and all that other stuff. And I think when you first start, they give you a certain amount of times you can apply two campaigns before um, before you're free to just apply to as many as you want. You have to get a positive review and after you get a positive review from your campaigns, then you're allowed to apply to how many that you want or whatever. So I've been using that a lot for my Instagram. There are paid campaigns and free campaigns on there. I will tell you that a lot of them don't be want to pay you unless you got a bunch, a bunch of followers. But I have had one paid campaign that I got um, off of there. So it's worth a try for the influencers out there, small influencers, like I'm small. I only have like 5.6K I think on Instagram and like 1800 subscribers so not a lot um but yeah just make sure you guys check that out if you're interested i hope this was very helpful um and yeah that might be it i'm trying to think oh i'm gonna show you guys the pr that i got in the last week or so this is the stuff that people don't show you they do when they're influencers but basically i took one of my soft boxes and excuse my dirty house because it's not that clean um took one of my soft boxes i have it here and i'm going to use that to light because like I mentioned earlier, I don't like yellow light. Like, no, it's not where it's at. So I'm actually gonna take this and I'm gonna adjust it. Can I do this with my hand? Probably not. My camera right here. And I have a Canon, did I tell you guys already? I don't know. I have a Canon T6i, I freaking love it. <laughs> Look at this, this will actually be a good shot. I don't know what I would use it for, but that'll be a kind of dope shot. Another package from Rimmel, and I mentioned these already, the glosses. So these are the other three that I got that I wanna try out. They're all pink. I think I would like this one. And then this one has shimmers in it, I believe. So we'll try that out. And then I also got two packages from Sally Henson. And look how cute these pack PR packages are. They're so cute. So one of them is for their Miracle Gel Matte Top Coat. So these are just like their gel um, polishes and then you put the top coat on it and it's supposed to make it matte. And I tried it out, but I feel like I did not put um, enough of it. So after a couple of days, it went back to normal. I only put like, I think I only put like one coat of it or something. Um, and then I also got their Mega Shine Strength Polish from them. And girl, this right here is what was on this finger, okay. Although it's jacked up right now, but look at that. It was so pretty. Received this PR package for Rimmel. It's like basically their whole Stay Matte Concealer Foundation um, like PR package. But I'm doing a dedicated video on this on my channel, so make sure you guys subscribe and have the notification bell on. If you watch this far and you're not subscribed, why? Come on. Like, I'm gonna give you a second. Just let's go, 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 let's go. Let's go. Okay, you hit the subscribe button, make sure your notification is turned on as well. well. Something I got from Aspire IQ to review is from Polish Choice, and it was this Omega Complex Moisturizer. I've already posted a picture of this if you want to check it out on my channel, well, on my page at the Lovely Bee on Instagram. So just like an example, they'll send you a product or whatever, and you'll post a picture or whatever they may want. But yeah, so the last thing that I got was this package. Okay, I can open this box. It's 
And this is from Clairol. It's like hair color. And it's so cute. This this was the little message from the company it was in this bottle, but I took it out. It's like a little wooden comb. And like, this is actually a candle, which I want to burn. It smells like coconut. But yeah, they gave me these four hair colors to try out. And this is supposed to just be like easy on your hair. No ammonia. It has aloe vera in it and coconut oil. So this is their natural instinct line. So yeah. They just sent me this. So exciting. So like all the stuff that I get, I will try to use or incorporate in some type of way into my Instagram or my YouTube, whatever it may be. This is going to my YouTube, but I'm probably going to use one of these colors to color some hair too. Um, but yeah, so that's basically everything. Yeah, that was like basically everything I want to show you guys. I hope you like this little vlog. I'm not done up. This is my natural face with my glasses. You know what I'm saying? Looking a mess. But I just want you guys to see like a day in the life, kind of like what I do on my off days when I'm trying to get content done and things like that. Now I'm about to probably edit this video, but also I have like two or three other videos that I have to edit um, because I'm trying to be more consistent on my YouTube. So for the next like two couple of hours, like I'm gonna edit and then I'm just gonna hang out and chill because I have to go back to work tomorrow and I wanna whoo, unwind a little bit before I go back. But anyways, if you watch this far, you the real MVP. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Turn on your notification. Um, your notifications so you know every time I upload and I will see you guys in the next one.